From a way to win $500 in cash to city employees increasing Santa stash. These stories and so much more coming up next on Richland Now. Hello and welcome to the latest edition of Richland Now. I'm Gail Everett. The holidays are going to be much brighter for children in our area thanks to the giving spirit of City of Richland employees. This year, staff coordinated two opportunities to give on behalf of area foster children. One toy drive was located in the City Hall Annex and the other was held at the Richland Community Center. Both toy drives collected close to 150 gifts for children in need in our community. Gifts included educational toys, books, blankets, and arts and crafts. Well, the holiday spirit is contagious and employees from the Administrative Services Department recently came together to discuss and select a need in our community. They chose Brookdale Senior Living Center as the beneficiary of their services. When they asked how they could help, Brookdale's only request was to have the two common rooms in their facility decorated for the holidays. The team had so much fun, they ended up decorating the two common rooms, the main lobby and entrance, and the grounds outside. The holiday decor was much appreciated, but staff and residents at Brookdale Senior Living Center say the friendly team and their holiday spirit is what will last inside their hearts. Well done. Well, I hope you have visited the Hapo Festival of Lights at John Dam Plaza. Just don't miss it. The beautiful light show runs every night in December from 5 p.m. to midnight. Walk through the plaza and listen to the holiday favorites as the lights dance around you or experience the show from your car while you are parked along the plaza. And if you need another reason to visit, Hapo has decided to give away $500 to one lucky person. All you have to do is visit the park, take a picture of yourself or your group enjoying the music, and upload it to Facebook using the tags at HapoCU and at RichlandWA. A random winner will be drawn on December 20th. Well, it's almost 2018, which means it's almost time to come up with a New Year's resolution. If this is a year for you to start exercising and live healthier, the Richland Community Center is a great place to look. The fitness room has recently expanded and is now equipped with state-of-the-art equipment, including a Vectra weight machine, free weights, dumbbells, and several cardio machines. The fee to use a gym is only $8 a month for an individual and only $16 a month for a family. The community center also offers plenty of healthy living, fitness, and cooking classes each month. Check out the e-activity guide for dates and times of classes. Our solid waste department would like to remind you that curbside green yard waste collection is running year-round except during freezing temperatures. That said, you still have a couple options to dispose of green waste. Richland residents can take their green waste to the landfill and dispose of it for free. And through December, fall cleanup is running and green waste can be bagged and placed at the curb on your regular collection day. Extra bags can contain yard waste or household waste. However, no tumbleweeds, hazardous waste, appliances, or tires are accepted. If freezing temperatures halt green can collection, we will report that information on our Facebook page. Well, the Richland Library is offering a fantastic literacy tool to anyone who has a valid library card. The Tumble Book Library is your answer to building reading, math, and multiple literacy skills. This program combines thousands of books into one easy access point, one super collection with one login. The content is most appropriate for those in grades K through 6. The collection is easy to access and can be found by visiting the library's webpage, clicking Programs and Events, Children's, and finally Tumble Books. All you need to do is enter your library card and you are ready to go. This service can be accessed by any computer with an internet connection. Well, the next installment of the Community Lecture Series is Equal Parts History and Hilarious. What happens when you take a secret World War II project, add a booming population, and build a city in the desert? Hmm, you'll have to ask Dupus Boomer all about the pre-fabulous Richland. 
Join Terry Andre and Connie Eastep as they use Dupas to introduce the people and the places of the Atomic Pioneers in Richland. Their presentation is Thursday, December 21st at 7 p.m. In the, in the Richland Public Library, and I strongly encourage your attendance. Well, the Special Olympics of Washington is asking you to chill out. You've got this. This winter, take your support of Special Olympics to new depths by signing up for one of the coolest events of 2018. Mmm, brr. No matter how big your splash or how long you'll stay in the water, you'll be a true below zero hero in the lives of the Special Olympic athletes you'll be supporting. Yes, we are talking about the Polar Plunge. And to plunge, you only need to raise $50. Each dollar you raise makes a difference in the lives of individuals with intellectual disabilities right here in Washington. And that's the really cool thing. Challenge yourself for charity and join us in For Reason For A Reason. As we go, I just want to wish you and yours a safe and memorable holiday season. Remember that all city facilities will be closed Monday and Tuesday, the 25th and 26th. Garbage collection will resume on the 26th. If you have any questions or seek information on any topic related in Richland, visit us at our webpage at the link below. And don't forget to interact with us on social media. Log on and give us a follow and like on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. I'm Gail Everett, and thank you so much for watching.